I believe everyone has encountered a situation that the soldering iron head cannot be tinned during the soldering process, so this video will definitely solve your problem. This doesn't seem very obvious. Alright, let's take a look under the microscope. Before we talk about how to restore the soldering iron head, let's take a look at how the soldering iron was burned out. In fact, it is not the temperature that damaged the soldering iron head, but oxygen. The high temperature accelerates this process. If you place the soldering iron in the air for a long time, the soldering iron head will also be oxidized. The theme of today's video is to remove the oxide film and foreign objects adsorbed on the soldering iron head, thereby reviving the soldering iron head and allowing it to be ray tinned. Some people use a blade to scrape, but this is actually not a good method, as it can easily scrape off the surface coating and damage the soldering iron head. When using, try to keep the surface of the soldering iron clean as much as possible. After a period of normal operation, there will be some oxidized solder or dried flux residue on the surface of the soldering iron head. It is necessary to clean it in a timely manner while it is still floating on the surface of the solder. Wipe repeatedly on a high temperature sponge with added water until the soldering iron head regains its metallic luster. After wiping, the temperature of the soldering iron head will decrease and the oxidation rate will also slow down. If you don't have a high temperature sponge, you can also replace it with a tissue, just fold it multiple times to a certain thickness, with or without water. Insert the soldering iron tip into the copper wire ball and rotate it several times to remove particles and oxide layer. Soldering iron tip revival paste specifically designed for this situation has also been developed on the market, which is a mixture of flux and solder. The soldering iron tip is inserted into the paste and repeatedly poked several times. After a period of time, the soldering iron can start tinning again. After the above operations, the soldering iron head can be tinned again. How do you maintain the soldering iron head? Please leave your comments below. This is Andonster. See you next time.